If you wanna launch a membership that stands out from the crowd, creating a membership app can help you do that. If you wanna increase retention for your membership by offering an on-the-go viewing experience, a membership app can help you do that. And if you wanna reach your audience on the screens that they use the most, well, I bet you know where I'm going with this. Launching your own branded membership app is now easier than ever. And the first step is to decide what kind of experience you want your membership app to be. What I mean here is that the way you structure your membership will influence how your members use the app. Do you want your members to follow a structured program or browse through your content library to find what they want? Do you want them to interact with you and each other in a private community? Well, if you start thinking about the member experience now, you'll have a much better idea of what features your app needs to have and what content you should make available on it. Step two of creating your membership app is also an important part of planning your member experience. And that is to decide on what platforms you wanna offer apps on. Between mobile and TV apps, you have a lot of options. If your cooking membership is going to feature recipes and how-tos, it might make sense to launch a mobile app first so that your members can take the videos with them into the kitchen. On the other hand, children's content tends to get a ton of use on TV apps. I say this a lot, but asking your members what they want is gonna be your best move here. Their answers might surprise you. People were quick to come over it because they, they they were getting an app. They were getting they were gonna be able to watch with their Roku. I didn't even know what Roku was, but it turns out homestars really love Roku. For mobile apps, launching on iOS and Android will cover just about every smartphone user. On the side of TV apps, you have far more options with Apple TV, Roku, Fire TV, and Android TV. Half of all TV app users stream using Roku, making it our recommendation if you wanna reach the most TV users with one app. Whether your answer is one platform or all of them, the next step to creating a killer membership app is to decide how you're gonna build them. Because you know which platforms you wanna launch on, you'll be able to rule out services or developers that don't build for those platforms. There are three categories of questions that we recommend asking when evaluating which app provider to go with. First is features. Do they have an easy to use content management system, payment providers who work with your currency, and a private community feature? Next, you should also evaluate their process. This includes questions like, how long will it take to launch? And will they submit to the app stores for you? The third category is critically important, and that's to ask questions about ongoing management. Who is responsible for maintaining and updating the apps, and how can you add new content? With these questions in hand, you're ready to explore the three main ways of getting a membership app built. The first method is to hire an app developer and build an app fully from the ground up. An individual or an agency can help you create an app to your exact needs. But be aware that this method is expensive, like ten dollars to $20,000 or more expensive, and can take three to six months to launch your apps this way. The second way is to go with a no-code platform. They sound simple, but it takes a tremendous amount of effort to create an app, and the self-serve platform means that you're all on your own for things like app store submissions. The third and easiest way to build your membership app is to partner with a membership platform like Uscreen that's already helped thousands of creators, big and small, launch their apps. This is the method we recommend because you still own your audience's information and the developer accounts while getting the benefits of working with a team that knows video apps like the back of their hand. If you build your apps with Uscreen, you'll have your customer success manager and a dedicated app specialist to help you every step of the way. While you take the creative lead to provide the assets like brand logos, app icons, and app store descriptions, your app specialist will do the technical heavy lifting. Once they have the information they need, the app specialist take care of the rest, including app store submission and continuous updates. If you want to learn more about launching a membership app with Uscreen, check out the on-demand demo linked on screen right now and in the description. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.